everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Kathleen and today's video we are going to be opening up my Owlcrate box for the month of September. So Owlcrate is a monthly subscription box. It is a bookish subscription box for young adult readers. It contains a newly released young adult book as well as about four or five little bookish items. It is $29.99 for a box per month plus shipping and there are monthly themes and the theme for the month of September is a glorious haunting. So let's go ahead and open it up and see what we All got. Right, so opening up the box, okay, uh, usually right on top we would have the Owl Crate spoiler card but that's not what this is. It looks like the first thing that we have is a blanket. Okay, so according to the Owl Crate card, Michelle Gray designed this flannel blanket featuring full text of Edgar Allan Poe's The Raven to be the perfect cozy companion to have upon a midnight dreary. Now we're wondering how to track blankets on Goodreads. So here's what the blanket looks like. It's very, very soft. It's like the, the Owl Crate card said flannel. And there is a picture of the Raven right there. So it is a very 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 beautiful blanket and I am in love and I love these blankets that are like text based I think they're just so pretty so the owl crate spoiler card was underneath the blanket and here is what the design looks like I think it's actually very very pretty and on the back it'll just tell you everything you need to know about the items in the box all right, so the next thing that I see is actually our enamel pin, and it's actually really, really pretty. It is a hand holding a rose, and it's just so Beauty and the Beast to me, but it is very, very, very pretty. The next thing that I see is a candle, which I'm very excited about. I love candles, especially bookish candles. Those are pretty good. All right, so this candle is called the Black Flame Candle, and it's Essence of Vanilla and Bourbon. It is an Owl Crate exclusive made by Novelty Yours. And here is what it looks like. Oh, oh, okay. It smells very, um, honestly, it smells more like dark chocolate. And I can smell a little bit of that bourbon. But it is a pretty good smell. It's interesting. So the next thing that I see in the box is a lip balm. And this is called Sleepy Hollow. An Owl Create exclusive. And it is pumpkin spice flavor. Which I'll probably have to give this one away. Because I don't like pumpkin. I know it's very sad. A lot of people tell me that I'm very sad for not liking pumpkin. I, I just don't like pumpkin. I don't like the smell of pumpkin. I don't like the taste of pumpkin. So it is what it is. <laughs> All right, the next thing that I see is inside this little um, package. Let's see what we got. It, it sounds metal-y. Like it, it's a metal. Oh, wow. Oh, it's an enamel bookmark. And here is what it looks like. It's actually very, very pretty. On the back, it says, Use this to mark your place in the book you're currently reading by placing the length of the chain between your pages as you would a normal bookmark. That is adorable. So I do, I do like it. It's very, very adorable. All right, the final thing that we got before we get to our book is actually inside this little owl crate box. On the back, it says, Monsters were unrestrained, unbound, and beautiful in their own destruction. So this says, It's a three-piece coffee spoon. It's inside inspired by the book bones by Amelia Lloyd Jones by Emily Lloyd Jones excuse me so they're coffee spoons that's really really cute there are three of them but I'm gonna go ahead and just show you what one of them looks like this is the silver one there's also a gold one but that is really really cute I really like that that's pretty yeah, so there's a silver one, uh, a gold one, and also a charcoal colored one. Alright, so that was the last of the items. Now we get to the book. The book that we got, ooh, they, they put it in plastic this time around. I, I like that. Um, so this is an Owl Crate exclusive signed editions of a Horrid by Katrina Leno. And I like that they put it in this nice shrink wrap. And of course, we do also get a letter from the author. It is in the back. So according to the Owl Crate card, Horrid is set in a dilapidated New England manor house. It's a contemporary horror story that explores the themes of mental illness, rage, and grief. That sounds awesome. This is also, again, as I said, an Owl Crate exclusive cover. 
here's what the original cover looks like. As you can see in the regular cover, the flowers are all blackish. Uh, they're a darker color. Al Cray decided to put a little bit of a pop of color into these by making uh, the flowers more like a rose red tint. So I actually really like this version a lot better. So I'm very excited. I'm not usually into the spooky themed reads. However, of course, Halloween is coming up and uh, it sounds really good. I probably will pick it up in October. I usually don't do themed reads like or seasonal reads as some people like during Christmas they like to read Christmassy stories or during Halloween they like to read spooky stories. I'm not really that person but this sounds really really cool so I can't wait to pick it up. And there you go guys that is all for this month's Owlcrate unboxing. If you are interested in subscribing to Owlcrate of course the link for the website is down below but I will let you know what the theme for the October box is. And the theme of the October box is legends and lore. Every October box will include a unique and useful item created by the fabric designer Janine Lacour. Okay, so they don't tell us exactly what the item is. It just says that it's going to be a useful item. Anyway, but I'm very, very excited. Legends and lore sounds so something super cool and it sounds like a really cool theme. So I'm very excited. Owlcray has never disappointed me before. This was a great, great box. It definitely wasn't my favorite, but it was a great box and nonetheless. Let me know down in the comments below which one was your th favorite item because I would really love to know. Anyway guys, thank you all so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Please give it a like if you did and subscribe to my channel if you're not already. All of my social medias are linked down below including Twitter, Instagram, and Goodreads if you'd like to follow me on those platforms. Hope to see you guys on my next video. Have a good day guys and keep reading. Bye!